Originally when I wrote this, it was Indiana Smith. And then when I told the story to Stephen on the beach, he said, I love it, it's fantastic, let's go with it. He said, there's only one thing I don't like. I said, what's that? He said, I don't like the name. And I said, well, all right. Well, what if we call him Indiana Jones? He said, okay, that's fine. Welcome to the Hollywood Gauntlet. Indiana Jones. Bella. I brought Larry into the picture because I had just bought a screenplay of his called Continental Divide. He said, I'm going to do an adventure movie with uh, George Lucas. And I showed him the script for Continental Divide, and we think you would be the guy to write this adventure film. And we spent three days with a tape recorder going. And in those three days, Larry George and I pretty much outlined and sketched in the whole plot, the set pieces, and we laid the movie out in three days, and Larry had to go off and put it on paper. In January of 1978, after a year of blockbuster success with Star Wars and Close Encounters of the Third Kind, George Lucas and Steven Spielberg sat down with writer Lawrence Kasdan to hash out ideas for a new adventure film featuring a hero named Indiana Smith. And over the course of three days, Lucas, Spielberg, and Kasdan continued to explore possible story and action scenarios, leaving a tape recorder on to record their thoughts. What is said, and later put down on paper, would turn into one of the most successful franchises and characters in Hollywood history. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. 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 Indiana Jones. I'm your host, John Jansen. Welcome to the Hollywood Gauntlet. Joining me for this Raiders of the Lost Ark story conference transcript are John Hargrove as Steven Spielberg. At some point in the movie, he must use it to get a girl back who's walking out of the room. Wrap her up and she twirls as he pulls her back. Michael Stevens as Lawrence Kasdan. Except there has to be that moment when he's alone with a can of beer and he just whips it to him. And John Jansen as George Lucas. That's another important concept of the movie, that it be totally believable. It's a spaghetti western, only it takes place in the 30s. Or it's James Bond and it takes place in the 30s. The following Raiders of the Lost Ark story conference transcript took place on January 23rd through January 27, 1978. George Lucas, Steven Spielberg, and Lawrence Kasdan met at the home of Lucas's assistant, Jane Bay, and proceeded to spitball ideas for what would become known as Raiders of the Lost Ark. The following is an audio performance reading of the original story conference transcript. The film starts in the jungle, South America someplace. We get one of these great scenes with the pack animals going up the mist-covered hills. Very exotic, mist-filled jungles and mountains. There's a... We've actually talked about it a little different from this, but you can correct me if I've gone off what we had talked about the last time. I'm going back, I think, to the original. Where he goes into the cave. This is where he goes into the cave. We had it where there's a couple of native bearers, whatever, sort of a couple of Mexican. Well, not Mexican. Let's put it... They're like Mayan. They're the third world local Sleezos, whether they're Mexicans or Arabs or whatever. They carry the boxes over their heads. They fall off cliffs. The Sleezos with the thin mustaches. Those are the peon laborers. And you have the two guys who are the local gaffers, foremen or whatever. The guys he hired. They speak English, the interpreters or whatever. We're assuming at this point that when we come into it, the talk is like they're sort of partners. He's a partner with these other two guys. He said, look, I'll cut you in on the stake. I'll pay you X number of dollars when I do this, if you do it. Well, they're not very trustworthy. Eli Wallet types. They're going up this hill, and they come into a clearing, and you see the temple across the way. All the natives get restless and start to split. One of the guys goes to him and says, the natives are leaving. They're not going to go any further. It's the curse of the Buddha or whatever. He says they can probably get there from here without them. So the three of us can do it. See if you can get a couple of them to carry on, to come along. They get about two or three guys to go with them. Our guy, the other two guys, and about three other guys. Three other natives who are a little behind. This is the Hollywood if I didn't care more than I 
than words can say if i didn't